the unified myofibrillar matrix for force generation in muscle. The forces generated by actin-myosin crossbridge cycling within each skeletal muscle sarcomere must be transmitted to the muscle tendon in order to produce movement of the skeletal system and it has long been accepted that force is transmitted longitudinally along the length of the muscle through the sarcomeres in series that form individual parallel myofibrils. The idea that a muscle cell is comprised of many individual myofibrils has resulted in thousands of studies on so-called isolated myofibrils over the past seven decades. This new article established a unified myofibrillar matrix connected by branching sarcomeres across the entire length and width of the muscle cell, which provides a direct pathway for both longitudinal and lateral active force transmission from within individual sarcomeres to the tendon. Branching of sarcomeres occurs in both directions along the longitudinal axis of muscle fibers, and branches in opposing directions often occur along the same myofibrillar segment, resulting in an interconnected zigzagging myofibrillar structure Thus, it appears that both the myofibrillar matrix and the cytoskeletal connections, such as Desmond, work in tandem to transmit both the active forces produced by actin, myosin, crossbridge cycling and passive viscoelastic forces laterally within the muscle cell. Big thanks to researchers who invest precious time in research of human body understanding. This review shows only the main part of the article. For more information, read the full article. The Unified Myofibrillar Matrix for Force Generation in Muscle, T. Bradley Willingham, Yuko Kim, Eric Lindbergh, Christopher K. E. Bleck, and Brian Glancy, 2020.